This then is the next dropper ready to be pushed up through the baseboard. Here is the wire that's already attached to the previous connection to the rail. This wire here is still attached to the reel of 24 slash 0.02 cable. Don't know if that will focus on there. It just says 24 slash 0.02. Uh, so I'm not going to trim that to, to length until this is already fixed in place and then this wire out here I'll stretch along to the next location and trim it to length. I left the insulation on the bell wire uh, rather than stripping it all off to make it all one length of bare copper wire. I can now trim that off because we no longer need that part. We're just left with the bit that will go up through the baseboard and which will be soldered to the rail the next part of the bus. Well, now I'm getting very ambitious because this one is right in against the platform edge. Of course, this is retrofit work. Another reason why it's probably uh, highly likely that you're going to get a dry joint unless you're very careful is, of course, this track is going to be tarnished if it's been down for a long time. It's not brand new out of the box. So, getting the track warm maybe a slightly larger solder blob than I really want. Um, the wire was spring tight against there. You don't want air gaps between the wire. What I do do if it's springing away is use something like the file that I've used to clean up the track to hold the wire once I've taken the iron away. The solder doesn't stick to the file but it just helps hold it in place so it doesn't spring away as the solder cools. Thank you. I've remade that connection because I wasn't absolutely sure that it was spot on, i.e. there wasn't an element of dryness. In the process I have melted the sleepers but I've also made a connection with a smaller blob of solder. It has nothing to do with the size of the blob of solder because you can see there's a big blob over there it's really to do with how well the solder is wetted both pieces of metal and I think or at least I hope that's a better electrical connection although it does need some cosmetic tidying up